Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll be giving my review for Christmas by Design, starring Rebecca Dalton and Jonathan Keltz. Um, they play Charlotte and Spencer. Uh, Charlotte is a, make, I guess she's like a fashion designer. She makes her own clothes, runs a little, be, a little uh, boutique. And she is asked to create two uh, Christmas outfits one for a man one for a woman <laughs> sorry <laughs> <laughs> and uh so she accepts the challenge um and if she wins this challenge then uh she gets a contract with the company um she ends up having a pipe burst in her boutique or whatever and she has to go back home for Christmas slash to make her designs. Um, so, starting off, the character of Charlotte is a very mixed character. She has a lot of, she has good moments. But she also has a personality that comes off very snobby, very like uh, she's better than everybody in the town that she, her hometown. You know the designer one. Christmas by Design, yeah. yeah. Um. So her character is just a very mixed bag, and she's unlikable, which hurts. Not only her character, it hurts the chemistry between her and the guy. Um, what's wrong? That's what I got. It's just falling. Oh. Um, and uh, that's one. Of, that was one of my big issues. Is is her character? Um, I like the character of uh, Spencer. He's just a. Uh, small town mechanic um, he has he's just a very positive outlook guy he he loves the town he's that he's living in I love him, by the way. <laughs> he's a very likable character and a character that I it was very odd that he would fall for somebody like her just because of how uptight and snobby she was at, at times um, most of the time um, I thought as for Christmas feel, this one was okay. It uh, it was better than like Under the Christmas Sky. Um, pro maybe a little bit better than Mystic Christmas, but I, I can't say that one for sure. Um, cinematography was was good. Um, I didn't like towards the end. I did not like the fact that she, I don't like what she designed. I thought the coveralls that she created did not look Christmassy to me. It did not make sense for Christmas for me. Um, I don't consider plaid Christmas, but the way it looked, it didn't look Christmassy. Well, I think too, like plaid, you, you see plaid being worn all the time, usually, by people. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah, at least down here in the South. So it, it to me it just doesn't scream Christmas. Um, well, she's from New York, so you gotta. Yeah, and that's who she's trying to impress is people up in New York. But you know, I would have went with some kind of like pajamas or something, something to look and not done plaid. Uh, I guess she was trying to be different, trying to give them something unique. Um, but uh, to me, it just it just looked ugly. Sorry if you if you loved that loved the look of it, and I didn't like that at the end that she got the job. I actually liked the fact that she didn't get the job at first. Yeah, I was gonna say the same thing. I wish they would have left that part like diminish it because I feel like her just realizing stuff and then coming back should have been enough. Yeah, like. Because now what's going to happen is, like, they're not technically, like, long, long distance, but, you know, how's that going to work? Well, because she ends up moving her boutique, 
down to her hometown because she decides to stay there because of him. But to me, when you end, when they when he calls her and says, you know, we want to sign you, you, you know, we lo I loved your thing, your your design. That really diminished the fact that she what that she gave up the uh, opportunity and to go and went back home when. To me, if all she had to do was create something and then show show him the design instead of going through a competition, why didn't they just do that? Also, I just thought of this just now, thinking about it. But at the beginning, when she meets this guy to mm -hmm. find out that she's going to be de designing a competition or whatever, mm -hmm. um, he even says, we saw your work, it just didn't fit what we were looking for, but it gives her another shot. So... That doesn't make any sense, but he'd go ahead and just randomly hire her either. I mean, I don't know. To me, the, the ending just very... Happen. It diminishes what she did, what she gave up. It diminished the whole ending of the movie. Um, but, uh, you know, it still wasn't a terrible, terrible film. Um... So, I ended up giving it a 3 out of 5. Um, but, it definitely isn't one of my favorites. Um, I wouldn't purchase this if it was a single a single that came out. More than likely, they're going to have to throw this one in with like a 6 film set or something. Or a 9 film set. <laughs> yeah, with stuff that I actually love for me to get it. Um, but... You know, it it still was it still was just a okay, uh, watchable film that uh, definitely wasn't the worst. So I try to think of anything anything else you want to say about it, or because I think I've said everything about no. the Christmas feel, the chemistry the being okay. <laughs> it's a Hallmark movie. <laughs> um, so everything that's everything we have to say. So please comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the bell to be notified for our videos, and we'll see you all in the next one.